This test chamber is divided in two parts. One where you get the three cubes, and another when you get to the exit. Good luck. Divided into two parts. Okay, still on a mountain. Apparently. Also, Nigel is just watching us now, which is not that strange, I suppose. <sighs> but he's just watching us without being watching from a camera thing, so that's the really strange thing about it. But anyway, we have blue gel and that's it. So we're going to have to figure something out here. He mentioned some cubes. So we're going to have to get those. I think we actually need to go over here to do that. So let's jump across. Put some goop there and some goop up there. Jump! Beep! Okay, we're good. Uh, I can't jump up there though, so I have to jump into this moving wall. Okay. Okay, good, good, good. Orange gel. First cube. Um. Crushes, okay. Just gonna wait. Go. Okay, second cube. Okay, now we have both blue and orange gel. And then we've activated the third cube, so that is also good. Uh, but now we need to head back, so let's do that. Please don't crush me. I have no idea how I'm still alive. Cool. Also, can I or can I not do something like this? I don't know if I can, but it'd be interesting. I can, apparently. That was a very, very risky thing, but okay. Now, let's put that there. And let's head over this way. Not bouncing. Also, I might want to actually not have that there. So let me move that. For a second. I want to get the furthest one first, probably. So let's put this here looking at that and then let's get the next one let's have that look at that this is all moving the portals as well by doing this so and then this one looking at that okay now we should have everything we need so let's get ready to launch ourselves through here we bounce off of that actually no don't bounce off of that what we need to do now is get rid of that cube there. And we need to make sure that that's not going to get in the way. Just going to wait for it to do its own thing. I think I should be good to jump through here now. And get up here. And now we need to get rid of the second cube. Which will allow us to get through the door. Cool. Good job planning. Your mama and papa should be proud. Who designed this testing protocol? Sometimes I feel this stuff is... They make this stuff up as they go along. I don't know why Nigel wasn't saying anything, but okay. There's a lot of glitches that I can just find, apparently. Now this test chamber is located in a real desert. Don't worry. You'll obtain a complimentary citranium can at the end of the test. I know I will. Citranium. It's science in a can. This test is brought to you by Citranium. Delicious and nutritious. And also full of science. Okay, anyway. Let's take a look at what we can do here. First off, let's get rid of the advertising because that's important. Obviously. I don't think I can reach that one over there, but that's fine. I can reach that one over there though, so... Reach all that up there, and that one over there. Just completely get rid of all that. Uh, and that one over there, if I can reach that. I don't think I can, but maybe I can. Science in a can. Please, 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 please. Okay, good. Uh, anyway, enough of that, uh, getting, covering all the Citranium advertisement. Let's go up here. And, uh, this doesn't do anything. Cool. But that's something you can do, so. It must be worth something. There's a funnel there. Funnily enough. Um... That activates that, so we need a cube. And there is conveniently one over there, so let's go get that. Might also angle this a little bit more than that. So we can make sure we go to the right spot. Let's launch ourselves! And grab that, and so we can head back now. 
We can't go through there without hurting ourselves, but we can go through here by ourselves to take a look around. Although I think we also need other stuff with us, so that's the main thing. Can't activate that. Uh, this switch is for that, though. So we can actually press that button. Uh, but anyway, let's take this cube back with us. To the thing we're supposed to do, be doing. Okay, and now if we hold this down while this cube's going up there like that. We can be completely confused by the physics of the game and just wonder what we're doing. Uh, let's go get that cube again then. And go back. Okay, send this on its journey. Press the thing, please. Thank you. And then once it makes its way over there, all we need to do is drop it. And now we can go pick it up. So let's do that. Just can't go through the red fizzler, otherwise we'll die. Also, that's on the switch already, so that's perfect. So let's just press that, which gets rid of that wall there, which is good for us. Um, but now, you also need to get it over there. So, let's go bowling and send that over there. We should get it over there. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, let's now launch ourselves over there again. Since we have to launch ourselves everywhere. All the time, every day. Oh my goodness, what have I done? I've done this to myself again. I just do it too much, all the time. Also, this reminds me. Let's get rid of that, and let's get rid of that as well. All good. Everything's great. Got rid of all of the... All of the Citranium product placement. Cool. Good. Let's go. Everything's good to that now. Let's get ourselves across. As best we can. What's the cube died? This is just rude. I think probably covering up the product placement has, uh, created some problems, possibly. That's fine. Anyway, let's try this again. Please don't die. Thank you. Should be good now. Crouch so we don't bounce off of the wall. Let's redirect this laser all the way over there. And now we need to go back all the way over to the beginning of the level again. Beginning of the test. Okay, very nice. Very, very nice. Very, very, very nice. Oh my goodness, speed. I am speed. I am so much speed, it's crazy. And there we go. I am upset. And then crouch to make sure we don't bounce, and we're good. Okay, just head over to the vending machine and... Well, it seems that we've run out of Citranium cans at the moment. Don't panic though, I will personally see that you get your Citranium can at the end of the test. Thank you. I need it. I need it a lot. I need it all right now. Give it to me. Do you feel angry at the end of a test chamber, or alone, or depressed? The new Aperture Science Exotic Location staging will eliminate all of those feelings by simulating the authentic outsides that the humans were born to roam. Hmm. It's so authentic, it's crazy. <sighs> Get gooped. Get gooped. Get absolutely gooped. Uh, anyway now, let's see. We have this here which we probably want a blue goop. We have this here which we probably want an orange goop. Let's do that. All good. Uh, so let's do a bit of this. Careful not to ruin myself. And we can put that on that, which changes that around. Cool. Good. Great. Let's fling ourselves across here and be very careful. So careful. Um, I'm gonna goop that. I don't think I need to goop that though. I think I need to goop that probably. Uh, but anyway, let's scoop this over here as well. We need to take the cube with us. There's a couple of cubes though, so... There's a few things. 
But anyway, let's take this over here. There's something back there. That's just a thing for Nigel. So put that on there, and that changes the light bridge there. Cool. Let's fling ourselves back across here. The control is just very necessary to not die. Now, I think I need to also destroy the cube over there if I can, can manage that. Which I can't really. But that might be okay. Might be okay. Um, because I believe this one respawns the other cube, right? Yeah, it does. Well, hello. So, let me take this back across then, because I'm missing something. Oh, I know what I'm missing. Hang on. Okay, so we put this over here. And now, for my next trick, a giraffe. But also, if we go through here, we can actually use this in reverse to actually go to where we want to go. Because we can bounce up here, get rid of that. And we're back here again. Cool. Let's just group this completely. Probably doesn't need to be that completely, but anyway. Uh, and now we can use the thing here again to launch ourselves into where we need to be. Just like that. Good job! If you think that you still experienced a negative emotion while testing, fill out the appropriate submission form at the end of the test. Okay. A not so fun fact. The water in this test is recycled from the old test chambers we were solving a couple hours ago. I would still enjoy the mist. Our Aperture Science water filter and cleaning systems destroy 99.3% of human waste. So if you took a toilet break early on, don't worry. There is practically none of your urine in the air. Practically. Cool, good, great. Just what I wanted to know. Uh, anyway, let's see. We have a few things that we can do here. Uh, the main one that we want to take care of, though, is actually going back this way. Because we need to go across here, which I could launch myself across for, or I could just probably bounce off of that there, but I'm going to just launch because it's probably simpler. Just a little bit. We can take that, which this is for the portal. So that changes that back and forth. Where's the blue portal now, though? It's not there. It's somewhere else. Unless it's just not activated at all, which it probably isn't. Cool. Let me take this cube with me. Okay. Now, what do I do with a cube? Probably just jump across here and put it on the button. You know, the normal thing you'd do with a cube. Okay. Um, we can bounce off of this as well to get up here. This is interesting. Um... Oh, is that actually doing something? Or do I need to do something? Hang on. Because that's spawning a thing. But I can't really... ...place shell there... ...to stop it from dying, and I can't really do anything about it... ...because I can't really go over there... ...without dying myself. So what I need... ...is something else. Hang on, I can I can gel the cute the orb, and then it comes to me, and then we can use orange gel, and it won't bounce anymore. That's that's clever. That's a good. That's very good. Okay, I need something else now. I can goop through that, right? Yeah, I can. Cool. Um, so now that all that is done, I think I need to group this here, and group that there, and bounce between the two, and then group that. Until it's destroyed and respawns on the other button to activate the portal. Which should... Fling me through there and bounce me off of that. To the exit. Nice flying there. If my calculations are right, you came into contact with 0.21 milliliters of your own pee. See? It's insignificant. Great scientific progress is what we do here. This chamber only uses the blue gel, but don't let that get to you. This is one of our toughest puzzles. 
Whoever designed this has evil intentions and no mercy at all. But I am sure you do just fine. Okay, well we're in space now apparently. Uh, this only has blue gel in it though, which is an interesting part of a puzzle. Can't take anything through there. But we have a cube here, so that's good. Let me just paint the earth real fast. Oh, I can't paint the earth. I can just surround it in something. Blue gel, I guess. Um, But this will change the flow of that. And this... That gets rid of that up there. Because it has the star icon next to it. At both ends. Uh, but we have this over here, which could be good for us. So let's jump into here. Oh, and also I might have needed to, uh... It's fine. I'm in here now. Uh, but anyway, let's go down here and goop, goop everything. Okay. Okay. So now, I goop that. Now that's no longer a problem. And now, if I'm not mistaken, that actually stops that portal there as well. And actually sends it through there. So now... Oh, actually, I probably should have done that differently. That's fine. I can do it from here now, so... Now that I know what I'm doing... Because that stops that... Or stops when it gets there, so that's unfortunate. Uh, but if we put this cube on the button, or even just stand on the button, I think would be fine. Oh, actually... Uh, actually, actually, actually. Oh, this is complicated. Maybe. Hang on, let's put that there. Okay. Now I'm going to try and get this to work, but I need to put some blue gel in there. Okay. Should be good. And now that's going to go through there. And now, what we want to do is take that off of there, and press that. And that's going to drop that in there. Uh, but now, I think I probably want to stop that there. Okay. Um... But now I have another problem, because I need... I need to get the cube through, is the main thing. Oh, there's another cube over here, though. So we need this, to be able to do everything else we need to do. Let's take this, and... We can't do anything with it though, because we can't take it out of here. At all. So... Well, how about I go back across to the other side and put the cube back on the other button. Oh, it is on the button. Let me take it off the button. Okay, and now we go back through because that's there now. Uh, and then we bounce off of this. And we just kind of fling it up if possible. I don't think this is working. Oh, almost. I don't think this is what I'm supposed to do, maybe. But that's okay. We're getting- we're getting there, right? Oh, there that goes. That's fine. Oops, press the button accidentally. Take that. Okay, make sure I get as much bounce as possible. Nope, there it goes. This is tricky. If this is even what I'm supposed to be doing. Okay, most bounce as possible. I need to let go of- I need to let it go as I'm moving the mouse upward. Not quite. I think I'm getting there, but I'm not quite... There. Nope, 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 nope. Ah! Am I doing something wrong here? Probably. Can't group it, so...
There we go. Okay. Oh, that's a difficult throw. Okay. Let's go put the button, the, the, the cube on the button. And now let's go put the cube on the button. Okay. That was a lot of difficult throwing. I don't know if that's the way you're supposed to solve that, but that's the way I'm solving it, so. The previous Aperture Science Exotic Location Station was so calm and peaceful. I hope it helped you with your thinking. Also, I'm not allowed to transform the Aperture Science official nomenclatures into acronyms now, so we'll just have to live with it. Although it will not be long for you. Because we are near the end of the test, of course. Okay. This is it! The last puzzle chamber! The final picture! The maybe not so grand finale! Maybe not so grand finale, okay. Why not so grand? <laughs> I mean, I can, I can do it right. Structures are extremely fragile. I'm guessing someone from civil engineering is gonna get sacked soon. Oop, I didn't mean to move put that up there. Come back. Got it. Cool. Anyway, let's see what we can do here. We have a few things that we need to do. That activates that. Okay. Well then let's put that into there. If I can aim properly. It's a difficult one to hit, but anyway. There's all that, and now I just need to take that off of there, and that should group up the stuff in there. I don't think I need to do anything else with that, maybe. Um, but it does look like I need the cube in there, maybe? Yeah, it does, but I don't know how I'm going to do that. So let's just take a minute and leave that there. And I'm going to jump through here. Okay. Now, jump across here. Oh, can I actually take... I can probably just take it through here, can't I? I don't know why I didn't just do that. Anyway, we only have the blue gel when we go in this way, so... But we have both orange and... Oh, orange and blue when we go back out again. Oh my goodness, stop bouncing, it's okay. Okay. I don't know if I want... Brilliant. Now go ahead and get on the platform ride. Is that safe? No, it isn't. Hang on. I need to actually... ungroup this because it wasn't supposed to be grouped like this. Oh, because it only lets me take blue in here. Right. Of course, I need to... I know what I'm doing. <laughs> this is all fine. Also, there's a spaceship thing there. So we put the orange group in there. Makes sense. I probably should have read the signs to know what I'm doing. And I would have had a much easier time with everything. So now we take this through. Actually, no, I probably don't even need to group there at all, do I? Unless it's grouped from the beginning. But I don't really know. Anyway, there's all that. Let's get out of here. And let's get out of here. Since this is the end. Okay. Go across. I'm very good. We are almost near the end of the test chamber now. Do not let me down. Okay, thank you. So training on this way. Cool. Oh, but we have some turrets. Okay, I can get rid of the turrets. With my goop. There we go. This goes another one. And final one. There we go. And more? More? Hang on. I can't shed out too many details, but get ready. Aim and fire. And someone from industrial engineering will be fired too. Oh, that's a shame. Well, so long for a dramatic and grand finale. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um... Citranium! We got some! And there we go! Our testing. I must say, you were a great Nigel. Test subject. And I am deeply Nigel. saddened by your fate. Nigel! Oh, I wish there was something I could do to save you, but you should know by now. Testing protocol. I've looked into it, and this one does have its good reasons. So, there's nothing I can do now. I will always remember you deeply. You know, Nigel? you were my first test subject. 
And that means a lot, even to a simple personality sphere like me. Farewell, my test subject. Nigel. No. Oh, I know. There's this loophole that I can apply so that there's no reason for you to... die. Oh well, I guess I'll just pick another test subject at random. Test subject at Will Science at some need and learn a new thing. For the people who are still alive. And that was Aperture Tag. So we lost at the end there. But you know, that's just how it goes to Aperture Science, so... <sighs> well, you know, it should have been obvious when he lied to us that we were... He actually lied to us a few times. So it should have been obvious that he was going to kill us. But this is a pretty fun Portal 2 mod, so... But anyway now, let me go back in from the last autosave. Okay, and now let's not go back that way. Let's not, let's not go where he wants us to take us. Because if we go back this way, all the way back this way, we can actually do our own thing and go up this way a little bit more. Put some blue goop there and some blue goop there. And jump across here. All the way. No, nope, not like that. We go back up here. We goop that. We goop there. And we bounce across. Sweet science! You have the bladder of a pregnant There's a woman. toilet. Go do your business and get back to the testing as soon as you are done. Cryptic hint system, thank you for participating. Oh, there's also stuff behind it that I can't really see. Uh, but anyway now, since we're here, let's scoop that wall with blue gel. Just absolutely everywhere. Might even be worth saving now that we're up here. Let me do that. Okay, and now let's group up everything up here. With our orange gel. Put some blue gel on the end there. And let's launch... Over here. Because there's a hole in the wall that I want to go into. Again? You did your business not so long ago. Why do you even bother with exploring your surroundings? It's not like you're going to encounter a life-changing moment. Or will I? Hmm... Maybe I will, or maybe I won't. But anyway, let's close these things up then. Yeah, yes, I've fooled you again. I am the one who's in control now. Anyway, let's head back and uh, finish up the test. Now that you got that out of the way, we can go back and finish the test chamber. Yes, we can. Don't, don't, don't. Oh dear, that did not work well for you at all. And someone from industrial engineering will be fired too. Well, so long for a dramatic and grand finale. Anyway. Give me my prize. Give it to me. Oh my goodness, there's so many. Look at all that. It's a trainium. And that concludes our testing. I must say, you were a great test subject. Uh, testing procedure says there should be a fire here. You die, and that should have concluded the end of the test. Um. Oh, I shouldn't have said How that. How dare you. 
Although I am very glad you did not have to die. Give me a minute. Okay, so your personality fits those of a previous test subject. She almost blew up the whole facility and killed my boss once. So I have instructions to let you go to avoid any future problems. Go through the door. I can do that. We've avoided death now. This elevator will take you to the surface. We won't meet again. This is it. Cool. Goodbye. You know, you were my first test subject. You will always have a deep place inside my gears. Farewell, my human test subject. Farewell, Nigel. Let's get out of here. Well, there we go. We've made it to freedom. Wait a second. Those walls look like oh walls. Oh hello. Oh hello. So yes, we have a a double way to die there. So there's no way to survive. But there we go. Anyway. But that is it for now, so thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.